Hi, I am Dr. Tinglestorm, and you can call me Stormy, and I'll be your neurophysiologist today. How are you doing? I'm seeing you checking in our reception a little bit early. Oh, yeah, so you might not like to come last minute, so we're on the same page with that. So get comfortable now, and we can start the exam, okay? I want to initially apply some water activated base glue electrodes on you okay so that we can catch all the information that your brain is sending us from the earliest stages of this exam I'm just going to kind of spritz, spritz, spritz to activate the glue and I'm gonna apply the electrodes on you so it's gonna feel a little bit cold maybe, okay? I'm just going to apply it's gonna be 24 24 electrodes, okay? going on in this moment but it's very important for us okay okay good just, just making sure that they are all correctly applied and safely attached okay everything is looking fine here I'm gonna ask you a couple quick questions If you don't mind I heard that you had experienced seizures in the past So, um, how long have you been experiencing them? Okay, so you didn't know what they were In your previous workplace, your co-workers would notice and tell you, but you wouldn't realize. Okay. How long do they normally last? Mm. How frequent are they? Do you remember exactly what happens during the episode? Do you remember having had any? Uh, and if you do, can you kind of describe a little bit what happens? 
Mm -hmm. And right after, how do you feel? Dizzy and disoriented. Yeah, makes perfect sense. By the way, right now in the monitor, I am noticing that you're having some little neck spasms as we are uh, getting started with the exam. Like, just the electrodes are reporting this. So, do you feel any particular sensation in this moment? Okay, are you probably a little bit nervous? If you can, would you mind notifying me if you realize that you're having the next spasms, if you feel them coming, or just anything about them? Okay, cool. So, do you have a family history of scissors, epilepsy, anything? Parents, grandparents, any siblings? Um, is there any history of any particular illness in your family? Do you have any health conditions? Are you currently taking any medications? Mm -hmm. So, do you happen to struggle with anxiety, stress? Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. Do you smoke or drink? How often do you happen to drink? Okay, so... Okay... These are all things that are very important for us to know. Do you drive? Okay... Alright, good. So, uh, now... The exam will start. It's gonna be a series of neurological tests. Some of them will be involving a bright light, but I will warn you when that will happen. My request would be to possibly raise your hand if you happen to notice that next pass I'm coming, okay? As the data here is showing that you've had a couple already, so just try to stay mindful in your body and report sensation that you perhaps feel, okay? Now, I am just repeating in your ears some words. I'm just saying them and I'm gonna ask you to repeat them for me, okay? What were the words? What's the animal? What's the movie title? What's the sweet thing? Okay, would you be able to say them on like from the last to the first? Okay, which is the animal? Good. Which are the words? Which is the noun? Which is the color? Which is the animal? Okay. So in these six words that I said, there are two animals. What are they? Condor and gazelle. Good. The sweet thing. And the color maple and purple. 
good movie title and the noun. first three words that I said. Good. Can you repeat the second set? What is the objective? What is the noun? What is the animal? Very good. Now I need you to repeat these words after me, okay? feeling in general any particular sensation that you need to report okay good okay so moving on I want to see your articulation movement now so I'm gonna wiggle either this or this finger and I need you to from your nose, either touch one or the other according to the wiggle you hear and see, okay? Nose, fingers, back to the nose, back to the nose. Disappear from your visual field. Uh huh. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Okay. 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 Can you follow my finger with your eyes? Just follow my finger. Good. Follow my finger. Follow my finger. Okay. Now, can you do this with your hands? Touching thumbs and index fingers together, like a spider movement. Thumb. to name a color, the first color that comes to your mind. Mm -hmm. Now an animal. Mm -hmm. Now a noun. Mm -hmm. 
a food a number okay noun number color food animal color number noun food okay good now I need you to tell me which color am I popping? Okay. Which color am I popping now? Okay. Now. Good. Now. Good. Now. Okay. And now. Alright. Great. Which color is this? And this. And this. And is this line the same color? 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 Okay, good. So now I'm gonna start involving the bright light to the tests, okay? So, you are in a safe space, whatever is going to happen, I am a licensed medical expert, so I'm going to be here to help. I ask you to be very mindful of what is going on right now, okay? So, the bright light is going on in 3, 2, 1. There it goes. I initially just wanted to look at the light and start getting used to the light into your visual field. Yes? Just look at the light. If you could possibly follow it with your eyes. Good. I would ask you now to look at my nose and tell me when the light is appears from a digital, digital field. Good. Great. Wonderful. Mm-hmm. Mm. Okay. I'm using a, an eye occluser to have a look at the pupil dilation before we go ahead with the tests, okay? So I need you to look at a spot behind me and I am closing your right eye flashing the light into the left Don't look directly into the light as it can be quite bright I need to see if your pupils dilate Good. It's a little bit slower response But it's okay Nice, we're gonna have a look at the other eye So if you're ready visual field into two halves to have a look at the consensual response instead, okay? Expecting that if I flash the light into one eye, the other one, sh the other pupil should dilate as well. So I'm gonna flash the light into your left eye first.
how are you feeling? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna quickly report this data and I see that you're still having the next passants to you receive them mm -hmm. Okay, good. So now I'm going to use this tool right here. I'm going to place it onto your eyes. And I'm going to have to be flashing the light here. It's going to create an interesting effect. And we're going to see how your nervous system reacts to that, okay? I just want to remind you once again that you're in a safe space here and everything is gonna be okay, okay? So, just placing this. So, look right in front of you. Look at me straight in the eyes. Good. Okay, I'm just pulling down this little pattern here. And I am flashing the light, okay? All right. Can you look at the light? Can you follow it as it moves? Can you describe what you feel? I'm noticing here that the spasms are getting a little bit intense. Mm -hmm. Okay, so um, the purpose of this exam is to push you to the limit. So, in a safe space, of course, as I said. So, if you don't mind, I would go ahead. Okay, I know it sounds crazy, but that's why you're here, right? Okay, so get ready. Is everything okay? Okay, I can see that you are a little bit overwhelmed right now. Everything is fine, okay? Do not worry. Now I'm using the occlusion again and I am covering your eyes. As soon as I uncover, I need to find the light in the space, okay? So I am covering. Covering, find the light. 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 Covering. this instrument right here, okay? And I'm gonna be shining the light. I'm just gonna adjust it to 
your eye distance like this see it's a measuring chart here so okay now I'm going again with the light okay I need to do here 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 follow Quadrant as soon as you can. Okay, how did that feel? Yeah, it's intense. It's intense. I apologize for that. Now we have a similar thing, but with a different tool. So I'm gonna place this close to your visual field, and I need you to. you feeling in this moment? Very dizzy and confused. I don't think you know this, but you just had a scissor during the exam. But that's okay, that's why we're here. You didn't even know this. It was not an intense one, okay? But I'll have to report that. you can. I'm gonna be touching your skin with this wooden chopstick, okay? And I need you to tell me where I am touching you, okay? Good. just want you to relax to the point when you fall asleep, okay? We want to see if you can fall asleep here. So we're gonna give you some time, okay? I'm going to dim the lights now, so it's gonna be easier for you, okay? I'll be right back.
to be to the much, Matt.